smart. Hi everybody, it's almost Thanksgiving time and you know what that means? It means sweaters, it means parades, it means gathering at a table with people you see about twice a year. It means turkey, carrots, peas, that weird green thing that your aunt always brings and no one ever eats. And it ends with pumpkin pie. Pumpkin pie. Pumpkin, pumpkin, pumpkin pie. Maybe whipped cream if you're lucky, huh? But more than anything, Thanksgiving is a national holiday. So it means we all have the day off. Day off, day off. Great. Who do we have to thank for this national holiday? The Pilgrims? Nah. Sarah Joseph Hale. Yep, Sarah Joseph Hale. Now I know what you're thinking. Who? She was a woman in the 1800s who was amazing. She was an editor of a ladies journal. Side note, Sarah Joseph Hale also wrote the hot poem, Mary Had a Little Lamb. My name's Mary, this is a lamb. And she decided in 1846 that Thanksgiving should be a national holiday. So she started writing letters to the president. And then the president, and then the president, and then the president. Then finally, the president in 1863, Lincoln, agreed. Let's make it a national holiday so that way that we would unify after the Civil War. No more North, no more South, all Turkey all the time. That's what they did. They made Thanksgiving a national holiday in 1863 because Sarah Joseph Hale suggested it. Boom.